वे टू स्टार्ट फ्रॉम या द फिल्म वॉज शॉर्ट इन कोची एंड आई सो लॉट ऑफ प्लेस इज वेर आई हैव बीन माई सेल्फ सो दैट वॉज रियली फन हेलो गायज आई मोर प्रिंस एंड टूडे वी वी टॉकिंग अबाउट द मलयालम फिल्म मुंबई पुलिस दैट इड बाई रोशन एंड्रूज रिटर्न बाय बॉबी इन संजय स्टारिंग पृथ्वीराज सुकुमारन जय सूर्या एंड रहमान एंड दीज थ्री एक्टर्स प्ले एंटनी आर एन एंड फरहान हु आर कॉल्ड द मुंबई पुलिस दैट्स वाई द नेम आई हैड रियली 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 हाई एक्सपेक्टेशन बिकॉज आई वॉज टोल दिस इज वन ऑफ द बेस्ट पुलिस ड्रामा पुलिस प्रोसीजर वेरी रियलिस्टिक हाउ इट्स रियली डन इन रियल लाइफ एंड आई वेंट इन टू द मूवी विद दैट एक्सपेक्टेशन आई डोट नो वाई डिड यू आई से दैट बट दैट इन हेल्प मी सो बिफोर वी गेट इन टू दैट फर्स्ट द थिंग्स आई रियली रियली लाइक अबाउट द फिल्म दैट वॉज द कॉन्सेप्ट आई हैव नेवर सीन दैट कॉन्सेप्ट एनी वेयर एल्स it was totally original and really intriguing to see how it all works out the ideas were there the writing was good well written and inspector solved the case but he meets with an accident and loses his memory and he has to resolve the case again such an interesting idea people are behind him he doesn't know who's friend who's enemy because he has lost his memory there are so many great ideas presented here there was so much potential but the execution let the film down for me now i know this film came out in 2013 and this film didn't age well i'm sure who have seen the movie that time they love it i think i would have even loved it at that time but for today's standards they are just very much straight forward issues with the execution i had somewhat similar issues with tamil film vikram veda i felt they had such a great concept such a great idea the writing was good but the way they executed it the ending everything just it just spoiled the film for me and this film also it was very inconsistent throughout just imagine you are eating a pizza but it's good only in some parts of it and rest is just bad a pizza needs to be good consistent recently and a film needs to be consistent throughout quite a hungry analogy for a thriller the film was just too slow for me and at one point it didn't feel like i'm watching a thriller i thought halfway through someone changed the channel i'm watching some other film altogether and you know why people say the thriller needs to be tight because people are engaged a thriller needs to be quick because if you give time for the audience to think you know to see what's happening they'll come to the conclusion they'll find who's the culprit is it will become predictable that's why the thriller needs to be very fast you don't give time to the audience you know to sit back relax and think what would have happened there were a lot of small small scenes in the film which led me to believe that the film was made by looking at other films they didn't go into their own research about how things happen and whatever knowledge they know about a thriller a police procedural everything they got all of it from watching other films and that's why i felt there was little lack of research that is just what i got from watching the film maybe that's not the case at all also there were some cool shots in the film i put some on the screen right now but again as i said the pizza analogy they were just here and there it was not consistent throughout the film coming to the editing it was kind of interesting to be honest i'll not say it was bad or it was really good but it was very maybe experimental but i think the scene where aryan gets shot i was really confused like he was just at the edge of the frame and he got shot and there was such rapid editing and i didn't understand anything i was like what is this and then i realized you know when events like these happen everything happens so fast that you don't realize what happened and you cannot recollect what happened even when you fall down you get hurt you know if you try to remember what happened at that moment it's all blank you cannot imagine what happened and i like this implementation to recreate that experience a lot of places it was a little off sometimes they were like unnecessary camera angles for the same sequence there's nothing happening to people talking and there's just camera coming from there then there's just a close up and then the camera is so far then it's close like unnecessarily two people are just talking i don't understand why you are showing so many camera angles as if the cinematographer wants to show off that i can do all of these come into the action the first action scene in the parking lot I think that just turned me off like I was out of the film at that moment. I think it came within 15 minutes of the film and uh no, it had no logic for me. Sorry guys. If anyone wants to explain me what really happened that scene, that scene didn't make sense at all. There was no logic in that scene. Yes, people were not flying, but that doesn't mean it's a good scene. Again that chase sequence well edited. Again it felt like you're showing off because that scene had no logic from a moving car. you kick a person on a scooter and you want to catch him he would have died and then there's whole chase sequence like just for the sake of it there's a chase sequence it happened but logically narratively it didn't make sense to me at all i know i'll get hate for this video by some of you some of you will agree to disagree 
I'm sure. And that's what I do on the channel. I am honest always. I cannot lie to please anyone. And that's how we reached at 10k today. And I'll not change myself just because we got a lot of more subscribers. I understand if you're getting angry. Even I would get if someone was saying these things for my favorite film. But try to understand my point of view. I couldn't get into the film. And I was just out of it. I knew I'm watching something on my laptop. And that should not happen while watching a film. I should be immersed in it. And if I'm not immersed, I'll automatically look at these problems. Because they'll come into my eye like a sore thumb. The background music. Oh my god. It felt like the background music is for another film itself. It's not for this film. It felt like it's a Bahubali kind of music and nothing like Bahubali kind of things are happening in the scene. There was so much background music unnecessarily, not needed at all. A person is walking and background music. A person is sitting background music. It's just so much music. Recently on Instagram, Prashant Pillai was doing a Q&A and I asked him, you know, how to know when to put music and when not to put music. And he said, first play the scene without any music. If it works, don't need to add music. If it doesn't work, then add music. This film needs to follow that advice. Coming to the acting, I think this was my first full feature film of Prithvira Sukumaran. And he was good at most places. Some places I was little... Okay, but supporting cast was just plain bad. Again, as I said, I was not into the film and I was just looking at these issues and you know it's not that i don't understand the culture i didn't get it it's not that i could really see why the characters are standing like this because they are staged so they can come on the camera when they are saying the dialogues they're literally you know it's like they're pause and they're told oh now your dialogue and they're saying it and they're stopping they don't know what to else to do they're just standing there sorry i just feel like i'm ripping this film apart it's not that bad of a film but it's not good as well because film is an illusion and if i can see through that illusion then the illusion loses all its charm i can see the subscriber count going down see as an aspiring filmmaker i have total sympathies to the character to everyone who made this film it's not an easy job to make a film it's a miracle if a film is made because it's, it's just a chaos on a set at the end of making the film if the film makes sense and is watchable it's just a big miracle and i can totally understand it but when you're reviewing a film you have to be very objective these things cannot come into the way of reviewing the film these factors does not matter the only thing that matters is the final product that I'm watching on the screen. So guys, that was my opinion on this film. I can totally understand if you disagree, but that's my honest opinion. And we can always agree to disagree. It had amazing concept, amazing ideas, even the writing was really, really good. But the execution failed for me. So guys, that's it. Thank you for watching. And if you like this video, hit the like button, share this video, comment your thoughts, definitely. And if you haven't subscribed yet, check out the videos and if you like them too, do with the subscribing and I'll see you next time. Stay home, stay safe.